Yo, what's poppin' boys and girls, ladies and gents. Welcome back to another episode of Kicking Their Bass TV. We got a banger for y'all today. Catching double digit bass out here at Stanley Southern Traditions. Big shout out to them. If you wanna check them out, you can actually get a beautiful little place out here and come out and go fishing. I'll leave their link down below. You can go check out Stanley Southern Traditions. Really great people. And all in out, it's just an amazing fishery. You know, we haven't caught a ton of fish today, but we, we, we've caught some big ones. We're about to go out now. We just got back from lunch. We're filming this backwards, but I ended up hooking a double digit. We have her on scale and everything. It was a crazy moment, man. You guys are gonna love it. I actually have some new Big Bass Energy merch that just dropped on the website. So if you guys wanna check it out, kickintheirbass.com. I'll leave the link down below. And also we have all the right hand bait casters, left hand and spinning combos on the website. The link will be down below as well. But we're going to go ahead and hop into this one. It's a good day. If you guys were a little confused about these clips that are about to come up, it's because we were actually filming with Lose and Strike King. Little photo shoot um, and also a little secret thing that's coming out later on. Um, but yeah, we were filming, taking a lot of photos for that. And I just happened to hook into this giant. So let's go ahead and hop into today's video. Ten pounder, dude. It's a freaking ten pounder, baby. Oh my god! I didn't think he was that big. Oh my god! Look how he's barely hooked, brother. That's a meatball. <laughs> Look at that. It just came off. Oh my goodness. I, I'll be honest. I think that's the biggest bass I've, I've seen yet. You've ever seen? Filming, yeah. Dude, I, that that honest. is like a. I mean. Oh my god. Dude, what in the dude? I'm telling you this line almost hit my nose he hit it so hard. Like <laughs> that was the hardest bite of my life. There's some chasing bait right there. Oh my god. He's right here. He's on the either. Oh, that's a good one. Here we go. Yeah, that's four pounds. Nice little three and a half pounder. Not bad. He slammed this thing so dang hard. I think there might be another fish in this cover, but. Oh, double digit. 
Old three pounder? Can't complain. I got I'm gonna hop on that switch. Get it, dude. Hey, cameraman Cody, GoPro. Oh, Boom, baby. The small one. Sure, brought you that good luck. Old Cody, I brought him good luck yesterday. You caught the biggest fish of the day when I called you, right? That's right. Yes, sir. Yeah, they're eating this jig, man. Okay. Little guy. Well, at least you kind of got it figured out. Yeah, no, for sure. All right, y'all. We had something happen today. I think y'all are gonna enjoy. We were out there, you know, shooting some stuff for striking and lose, and uh, also some surprise things as well. I ended up hooking a tank, and I, I don't know if he's between, I don't know if he's nine pounds or if he's 11 pounds, but this sucker is huge. I'm gonna tell you, like, bare minimum, nine and a half. Bare minimum. Maximum, I would say 11. But this this thing's a tank, so yeah, we're gonna right. show y'all. You don't believe me? I don't know. You, ha you haven't seen it yet. These boys haven't seen it yet either, yeah, I'm so. I'm excited. <laughs> I, I told them, I was like, you gotta open the live well. So if, when you open it, he's gonna be right by your feet, Fletcher, on that side. So I'll let you guys take a sneak peek. No and then we're gonna weigh him. Lying. So we got, hold on. Everybody knows he catches a five pounder. Oh, it's a 10! <laughs> it's five pounds, bro. So if he says it's a 10 you pounder, you know what's funny? It's probably this, about a five. This time was com the complete opposite. Like, I hooked him and I thought he was like a seven, and then I netted him and I was like, dude, that's a 10 pounder. So we got two scales that we're gonna weigh him with. Uh, we got this scale and then Fletcher scale. We'll compare the weights, but I'll let y'all look, man. He's, he's right here. Let me, let me see, take a look at this. He's good girl. and healthy. Oh my God. He's a two pounder, bro. <laughs> dude, pull him out. <laughs> dude, pull him out, dude. You want me to grab her? You want, you want, let me do the honors? Oh, oh, oh my god. god. That was a tsunami, dude. Dude, dude I'll dude, tell you, that fish on. is strong, bro. <laughs> oh my <laughs> gosh. Wait till you see your belt. <laughs> Dude. That's a take, bro. Oh my gosh. Oh, that's the biggest fish I've seen all year. I'll tell dude, you, at least that. Dude, turn that's that thing to the boy. side, dude. Look at Look the at belly. That. <laughs> <laughs> that's a big old right. girl. So, what do y'all think? Dude, she's I, a double digit, man. That's, you think that's, that's a 10? Yeah. I think she's going to get a yeah. 10. That's I really a double do. digit. For sure. I really do. What do you think, Cody? You think she's 10? Look at that dog. <laughs> dog? <laughs> oh, there's a power pole there. <laughs> but that ain't a dog. That's a dog. I think it's a high nine. Probably. High nine? Let me ask you a question. If it didn't have the belly, what would you think it would be? If I, if it didn't have the belly, I'd say like maybe an eight and a half, nine. Probably That eight, thing looks dude. like it swallowed a shoe. <laughs> <laughs> he's, he's got 12 coconuts in his belly right now. So we're going to weigh him on this scale first. As you can tell, it's zeroed out. Hold her tight because yeah, hold, see how big her Adam. lip is? Yeah, let me uh, So move your hand. See, I can't even get this around. <laughs> like if that fish got any bigger, I don't know how I clamp it. Alright. Here we go. Oh my god. <laughs> oh! What do you think? Oh my god. <laughs> it is a double digit. <laughs> it's a ten and a half pounder, buddy. It's a ten point four nine. Oh, Gosh, dude. 10.49. That is massive, bro. Dude, <laughs> absolute <laughs> unit. Unit, boy. <laughs> dude, that's wild. That's our first 10 pounder on scale this year. We've caught one about close to that. You know, I'd say this one's a little bigger, but that is a mammoth, dude. That was dude. a mammoth. And I'm glad I, you actually have a scale today. Like, you never I'm, have a scale. Dude, I never, never have a scale. And it's funny because me and Cody talk about it all the time. We're like, Dude, if we bring a scale out, like we're not catching them. Like it's just, I don't know what it is. But today I had it sitting in the seat. And funny story, you know, we had we had a camera guy on the boat, and we were idling out, and I didn't have any GoPros. Cody was over here, so we we're just taking photos and stuff. And I told him, I said, let me go back real quick and get this dash cam because we're gonna end up catching a double digit. Like just joking around. And 20 minutes later, ten and a half pounder. All right, boys, we got this mammoth. Just got a quick picture of her. We're going to get her back in the water. That is that is a dinosaur. Ten and a half pounder. Wait, was it 10.49? What a tank. I mean, oh my gosh. Look how fat her tail is. Just her stomach. Just a beautiful, beautiful fish right there. This is Big Bertha. Look at that thing, dude. This is why we come to Stanley's. Yes. 
big shout out to Stanley's by the way for letting us come out today you know last time we came out we got our best 10 fish were for 50 pounds and, and we never we saw one like this so you're kicking look at it look at that yeah you got it she's tightening up there she goes oh, she went shallow she gonna get you buddy look at old buddy right there <laughs> that was a moment bro that was sweet and i'm just glad we had the scale because i already know how much do y'all want to bet if we didn't have the scale today and we put that thing on camera that people would call that a four or five pounder <laughs> I, i'm serious people are that pretty they probably call it a six, six, seven, six that's what seven, i'm saying yeah. man but then again, the camera doesn't do the justice. Never. Like, I'd be surprised to go look on this and be like, he looks big there, you know what I mean? Yeah. But man, that was a good no. fish. That's <laughs> that's wild, Is dude. Is that the first fish you caught today? Yeah, yeah, <laughs> literally, literally the first fish. So, I don't know After what else that, is going on. He quit fishing. <laughs> Let's All end right, it on boys, a good I'll, I'll catch y'all later. Go I'm, I'm gonna go home, <laughs> I'm gonna go relax, kick my feet up on the lazy boy. But uh, no, it was good. So, we gotta get back in the water, but first, we're gonna go get some lunch. We're hungry, so we're gonna go grab some grub, get back on the boats, and then go out here. And we're gonna try to catch some big ones. Yes, sir. Uh, it's good to have the boys on the channel. You wanna check out Fletcher's channel? Link will be down below. Check out my boy Adub's channel. Link will be down below. But let's uh, I'll catch you back up with you guys in about an hour. Alright, so we are retying. This is what I caught old big boy on earlier. Old big jig. It's about Strike King. If you guys want to get a discount on any of the lures I use or lose fishing combos, not the kicking combos, but any of the lose combos on their website and Strike King, um, I'll have my discount codes and links down below. But yeah, this is the jig that I'm rocking with. It's a half ounce green pumpkin jig. Has a little bit of chartreuse in it. And I paired it up with the chartreuse rage crawl and man I, I caught three fish on this earlier i think they're about to crush it. i really didn't fish after that like once i caught them fish i kind of just like stopped fishing we we're taking a lot of photos so i think this is going to be the secret bait today that's going to end up hooking some more big ones i'm hoping we can get on another double digit that would just be dummy um but yeah we're gonna go ahead and hop into it guys let's see if we can hook a tank They're gonna be about a 11 and a half. Gotta be. Honor, the bite has been a little slow today, guys. It's, it's not like it's been great. But then again, I haven't fished a ton. But Adam and Fletcher were fishing a good bit. By the way, uh, they're, they're out with us today. And they, they didn't have too much luck. Fletcher caught something from the bank. I don't know. I'm just hoping we just. If we can just hook a couple good ones, I'll be happy. Shoot, I'm already happy. Who, we who wouldn't a, be? We caught a mo monster of a bass. So he came up on this side of the boat first, and I seriously thought it was a five, six pounder. I, I literally, if I would have lost the fish, that's what I would have called it. Like I yeah, I lost a five or six pounder. I didn't know till he was literally in the net. Opposite from what usually happens, right? That's what I'm saying. We're like, oh, it's a, oh, we just got it hooked weird. Yeah. I don't know, dude. Dude, holy cow. I don't know if that fish is big or not. He's tiny. Okay. <laughs> the way he hit that thing, dude. Oh. How you catch a 10 and a half pounder and then catch like a half pounder? How does that work? This fish is so cold. That's a twinky guy, but hey, after the lunch sesh, First fish. See a dude. Holy God, la la la. I can't tell if that was a bite or if one of them leaves hit me real good. But I don't know. Remember I caught like a five there. Mm -hmm. 
You got him? Tiny guy. Hey, he's a fish. You barely load up on it. Yeah, I didn't even know he was on there. <laughs> Went from catching giants to twinkers. Well, twinkers. Twinker doodle I'll doos. For, for first That's what I'm saying. Day. Yeah. Just watching you catch that or seeing that big one today, <laughs> made today. Worth it. Worth <laughs> it, yeah. I don't know. I think this bank we're about to go down is going to be pretty good. There we go. Nice. Pretty guy. Yeah. Goes. Right there. Come on, baby. Another 10 pounder. Oh, right at the boat. Big one? Oh, nice. That's a good one, dog. That's a good one. Yeah, yeah I'm going to power pull it down. Hey, the right at the boat. Nice. That's a good one, Bubba. Yeah, that's a better one. Three pounder. Really weird color, isn't it? Like light. Yeah, well, once it starts to get colder, too, you know, some fish start to get a little lighter. Yeah, he's about three. Yeah. If he's not, he's a high, too. Yeah. That's a good fish. Heck yeah. Nice. That can. A lipless. Mm hmm. See you. Good job, man. Thanks, hey. man. Bam. I got one. Oh. No, he came off. I was too far away, dude. I didn't get the pressure on him. But oh, tickle my pickle. Tickle you. Oh, oh, come on, eat it, dude. What in the mess just happened? I mean, dude, just like do 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 do. I mean. He hit you got him <laughs> you think that's him maybe yeah the, look at him he looks like one that would just be like Whoa. yeah he totally does yeah. so they're eating the trap they're eating something they're re reacting to but i feel like this jig could get another big one so i don't really want to put it down my bad no, <laughs> yeah Dude, you just landed. You didn't even reel the thing. I know. Literally, I heard your bait hit the water and you were like, there's one. I I'm thought like, it was a log at first. They're all small though. Oh, that's a good one. That's that a two pounder. Yeah. Okay, or a pound and a half. I thought I heard Adam go, woohoo, but it was your trolling motor. <laughs> nice, nice. Not big, but nope. hey. Oh. It's all good. Yes, sir. It's a fun bite. Yeah. Between here and this point, there's got to be a five, six pounder here. That's where I had that bite where I was talking about the jig. See if he's still up there. Yeah, I missed him, dude. He hit it so hard that I just thought I was bumping off a rock, but he was running with me. Didn't feel like, I don't know. You got him. That's him, buddy. We're just talking about it. I'm gonna grab that net for you. That's a big one. Ain't it? It's a four. You want me to get the net? Yeah, if you want to. Okay. He is not even that, dude. That's oh, a two yeah. and a half pounder. He looked a lot bigger, Three, he? no, he might be a, I mean, he's a high too, dude. That might be a, close to three. Yeah. That might be a three pounder. Dude, that, that's a uh, stubby. Yeah. That's a fat one. That's, a, that's probably two and three quarters, dude. Like, just look at his, Thickness yeah. of his tail for his size. That's a good fish. Heck yeah. Nice. That's plenty. Yo. Oh my goodness. Wait, he's, he's not that big. Dude, I was reeling it in. That's what happened to me a second ago. Maybe that's, it's like a reaction bite. Boom bite. What would you say, two and a half? Yeah, easily. Just popped him right out. It's a nice little fish. Yeah, do that. Like, I had a bite a second ago, guys. I'm, like, dragging it. And I, all of a sudden, you just don't feel nothing. I'm like, that's exactly what that one did. But see, I hook set, 
and dude it just started taking off to the right so i'm like oh man i might have <laughs> i might have me a huge one all right y'all man we're gonna end off today's video it, it was a good time i know you love the double digit videos and we had our scale today so that's a plus right yeah. <laughs> um ten and a half pounder that's crazy man we had a good time caught some other big fish uh cody fished with me the last hour or so uh, he ended up catching some too it was just all, overall a good day man there's not many times where you get to run into a 10 pounder that's one of my top five biggest bass ever which is awesome um and man we had a good time if you guys enjoyed it please hit the like button share this video with a friend because i'm gonna be honest i've never seen a freak of nature like that in my life let's make this video go viral help out your boy i'd really appreciate it um check out some of the merch down below check out some of the rods kickingtheirbass.com i appreciate the love and support catch y'all in the next video